today we discuss about total number of commutative binary operation defined on a set in previous episode we already discussed total number of binary operation so please listen this topic total number of commutative binary operation defined on a set listen here what do you mean by commutative binary operation commutative binary operation means suppose x and y are two element in a set not in a set g if x star y is equal to y star x then star is called commutative binary operation listen here if x and y are two element in a set g if x star y is equal to y star x then star is called commutative binary operation please listen here suppose a set contain g contain total n elements total number of elements n so we take two elements from n elements we take two elements from n element that can be done how many different ways in c two different ways what is n c two different way that is n into n minus one divided by one into two okay okay first of all we take two element from n that can be done how many different ways n c two different ways what is n c two n into n minus one divided by one into two so we take x y y x Okay, that type of elements. Then x star x is equal to x star x is also a commutative binary operation. Then that can be done how many different ways? Total n ways because <coughs> set G can be an element. Then we get n square minus one divided by two plus n. That is equal to n square minus one. Plus n divided by two, two n. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Two n. N square. Please listen. N square minus n by two plus n. That is n square minus n plus two n by two. So we get n square plus n by two. So n into n plus one by two. Please listen. The definition of binary operation is g star g mapping to g itself. Since star is commutative binary operation, g star g contain total n into n plus one by two elements, and g contain n elements. So total number of mappings are n raised to n into n plus one by two. That is a shortcut method to find total number of Different commutative binary operation defined on a set. Please listen this formula. Not this. Total number of commutative binary operation is equal to n raised to n into n plus n plus one divided by two. Total number of commutative binary operation. We know that total number of binary operation means n raised to n square. Total number of commutative binary operation is n raised to n into n plus one divided by two. And total number of binary operation is n raised to n square. Please listen. For example, suppose a set containing two elements. Two elements. Suppose a set containing two element. Then elements. Then total number of commutative binary operation is total number of commutative binary operation is equal to n raised to n into n plus one divided by two. So we get here n is two. Two in raise to two into two plus one divided by two. Here two two cancel. Two raise to three. What is two raise to three? What is two raise to three? That is equal to eight. That's answer. So total number of commutative binary operation is equal to n raise to n into n plus one divided by two. Here 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 n set contain two elements. So two raise to two into 2 plus 1 divided by 2. Here 2 2 cancel. So we get 2 raised to 3. What is 2 raised to 3? That is 8. Please listen, student. 
total number of commutative binary operation we have if n a set contain n element then the total number of commutative binary operation is equal to n raised to n into n plus 1 divided by 2 and total number of binary operation is n raised to n square that's all okay students if you interest in this video like and share comment it okay bye